Hello everybody, my name is Tananye and welcome back to The Sims Tree World Adventures Part 17. So in the middle of the night, her journey was actually came to an end. So I had to go back and then bring her back here. This is why it looks like we have a whole new kind of um, day going on that bloody pomegranate thing and I did look up the pomegranate and there is one place to get it but apparently you only get like one every time you harvest and I just kind of feel oh my <sighs> uh, <laughs> I just kind of feel like no is the answer to all of this stuff why are we not getting anything I'm like losing my will to live now okay so we're gonna have to do the tree pomegranate thing Okay, let's just do that. Let's get two pieces of titanium. Whatever. Um, so I don't know which ones are titanium. So I'm just going to assume it's them. And I'll check in on this house that does have the pomegranates. Um, but to be honest, it's like, it's, it's like one tree. Like, I, I really don't see it. Yeah, like it's nothing is really harvestable. Uh, which kind of sucks, but that's okay. We can only do what we can do um, And I'll just have her deliver that metal. You see this is the thing with world adventures that drives me mad I know there's like loads of tomb things we could be doing but for some reason it just doesn't want to give them to me But I suppose then it, it lends into that's why everybody has such a different experience I suppose when they play world adventures, so Yeah, we'll just roll with it and say that's the No. Come on. Oh, okay. I can begin building my new nectar machine with these materials immediately. However, it turns out I forgot this one crucial component for my nectar maker. Could you speak to Adele Durand and convince them to give you a nectar whiz computer chip for me? I'd really appreciate it. <clears throat> yeah, we can do that. I mean, I pretty much guarantee we don't have a relationship with this person, but we will in a few minutes. So it's going to be all good, and I think this is her here. Yeah, it is. Okay. But she's not going to want to have anything to do with us. Um, we need a local. Let's be friendly. Oh, okay. Maybe friendly introduction. First things first. No, I don't want to talk to you. We're busy. Oh, hello. I like that. I like that sort of introduction. I think it's really cute. Really cute. Uh, make a silly face. Internet cats video. Um, ask her sign. Um, discuss am I discussing adventures twice? I don't want to do that because they get bored really quickly then and you can really bugger this up. Um, friendly. Talk about cooking. I think it's a pretty solid assumption that that these French um, sims want to talk about cooking. I could be completely wrong though in, in all fairness, like I really could, but it's fine. Uh, it's okay. Discuss <laughs> adventures again and then be funny, make a silly face. Tell a funny story. And hopefully this will get us close to what we need with regards to the friendship. To convince her to give us what we want and what we need. I think we could be getting pretty close. So I think she... Well, let's compliment her. Um, what else could we do? Talk about books. We'll take a chance. She might hate it, but she might like it. So... Let's just go with that and then convince him. And hopefully we have enough of a relationship to do this. I think we're nearly friends anyway, so. Oh, deliver the parts. Deliver the parts. Let's go. Let's go deliver the parts. Come on. I didn't know that this was actually going to turn into a second mission. So that's kind of nice. At least we're not just doing like one mission which is will be kind of annoying and these air traps are happening at the nectary i have realized so i am going to avoid doing anything at this really at all costs because it's showing up error after error after error 
I just don't want to have to have to deal with that. To be honest, it's annoying and it could glitch my game. So no thanks. Uh, own a venue. I mean, yeah. We, we, I don't know why I locked that in as if like I'm playing by myself. Like, oh yeah, let's just on a venue. That is not the purpose of this. Let's play. Stay focused. Okay, come on. And let's hope the board gives us something good to do so that we can, or even just something quick would be, would be great because then we could just do the something quick and, oh my God, these bloody pomegranates are going to be the death of me. Use the provided fruits. No, I don't want to go to the nectary. Oh my freaking god. Okay, I think this is like a, a no-go to be perfectly honest. Yeah, look at this. Like, no. Alright, so I will... Let's see if the house has the stuff that we're looking for. Oh my god, I'm sorry. I am yawning. That is so rude. Ugh. <laughs> oh, that's so annoying. Okay, so we can't redo that. And if we want to get frogs, we pretty much have to fish for them. So what I think I will have her do is learn, learn, learn this, learn the cheese plate. Because this is part of what we have to do anyway. So I feel like while we're waiting for that to reset, we can be learning some of these, um, what you call it, recipes. Like there's no, there's no problem with reading some of them anyway. So it's not going to hurt. Let's sell this stuff. Um, what else do we need to do? We need to eat a morsel. And after that, I think I will have her just go to bed. Um, yeah, I think that's probably what I'm going to do and hope that the board thing resets and I can, um, have, what is this? Uh, complete skill achievement. Okay, I don't know what she achieved, but that's okay. Um, and then come here and sleep after that. Or she doesn't need to sleep in there. She can sleep in here. Cool, yeah. Come here and sleep in here once she has that completed. Although it looks like it's taking a little bit of time. Let's be honest. A little bit of time. Okay. So she's done now anyway. So I will let her get on with her business for tonight. And I will come back in the morning when she has woken up. And hopefully there will be some good missions. And we are back. So let's have her get ready. And I have high hopes for this board today. I hope it works. I hope we get something good. Because I am kind of stuck if we don't get a tomb. Which is... Mm little bit disheartening travel to Egypt oh Jesus no we're not traveling to Egypt oh my god these freaking pomegranate missions I just want them to disappear out of my life okay that could be a potential with the interview thing so let's keep looking no that's nectar um, <clears throat> frogs no let's go again Okay, so we are going to do the interview one because I cannot do any of the other stuff. So interview. Now, what I am going to do first of all, before I even do this, is check in to see if these pomegranates have... Oh my god. Okay, so we need to come here and harvest these pomegranates in case this mission comes up again. Um, because I just need to, I just need to have these. It's driving me bananas. So we're just going to take them. I don't know how many we're actually going to get, but let's see. We got four. I mean, that's not bad. So I'm pretty happy with that. Um, so we could, like, if we get that mission again with the going into the house thing, we can definitely do it, which makes me super duper happy. Super happy. Okay, let's interview this Happy lady. Hmm. She's not going to want me to interview her. I'm probably going to have to build a relationship, yeah. Okay, friendly introduction. Hello. Uh, friendly, discuss adventures, compliment her home. Um, ask her sign. 
Let's be like a little bit funny. Um, make a silly face. Friendly. Um, get to know her. Friendly. Talk about books. Friendly. Share a secret. Friendly. Oh, I didn't mean share a secret twice. Uh, friendly. Shakabra. Um. Let me do anything else. Uh, maybe talk about books again. Then we could be a little bit funny again. Oh, she's. She has a good sense of humor for us to be able to do these things with her, so... Fingers crossed, after all of that, it will be enough to interview her. So let's power through this. Power... Oh, she didn't like that, whatever it was. I don't know what it was she didn't like, but she didn't like something. Please. Yes! Ah, oh, thank God! Thank God we got that finished! Right, let's give her the information that she's looking for. Mm -hmm. Here's your information. Enter the lot. Oh, oh, it's a mission. Your interviews revealed that Ad Admiral Langrab was also studying the history of Nectar nearly 60 years ago and that he may have notes about what he learned. Unfortunately, Langrab was a rampant conspiracy theorist and worrywart and his home is shut up tighter than napoleon's tomb take this key to his library and try to find the papers it should be near the front of his home please be careful okay let's go to the land grab place <clears throat> let's go to the land grab house 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 okay so i think we're here are we here all right so um um can we just go in the front door nope we cannot so it means we have to go through the back door which has disarm this maybe can we disarm okay Go through the door. All right. Why can't I see her inside the house? Oh, I can't. Okay. I can't go through that door. I can go through this door. Okay. Hmm. I go through this door. Oh. Is there traps though? This is my. Th oh, look at this. Inspect. Mm. There's traps. Of course there's traps. There's always traps. Can we disarm? Can. Oh. Mm. Okay, so can we pull this far then? Maybe stop there. Then pull it by one. And then push it. And that's one way to disarm. That is one way to disarm. There doesn't appear to be one there. So let's put the keystone in. And this is how we get into the library, it would seem. Collect this. Light the fire. I don't know why, but let's just light the fire. Collect this. Um... Does that do anything? I just think it's really suspicious that it's here. No. It doesn't do anything. Um, come here and open this. And then open this. Why is this radio here? Oh my god, that was so lucky. Okay, take all. And we can then deliver the paper. Okay, deliver the papers. Let's go. Alright, so at least we got that done. And I assume now we can go through that door, which is perfect. If we have to go in there in future. Which will be great. 
Let's just give her her papers. Oh, bless you. She's sneezing everywhere. Bless you. Here's your papers. Okay. Uh, I refuse to let the Admiral Langrab's code get the best of me. Gaston is a well-known cryptonologist. In fact, Gaston deciphered the legendary Vaughn cipher that... Tumt? Is that? Adventures for years? Take the nectar papers to Gaston for translation. Okay. Deliver the papers. Let's go. Deliver the papers to Gaston. Can you translate them for us? Okay. Take these papers and decipher key to Noelle St. James. This should give Noelle St. James all the information needed to complete the current research on Nectar. Ask Noelle to send me a copy of the finished report, will you? Okay. Deliver the papers. Oh, she's in a car. Damn it! Stop moving! Damn it! Come on! Can we deliver the papers? Deliver the papers. Hopefully she's stopped where she is and we can just deliver her papers to her. Here are your papers. Okay. So we did that chain and we actually kind of got to do a tomb slash mansion -y house. So I feel like we are winning today. We won today. Um, come here and sleep. Okay, so on that note, I'm going to end this part here. Um, so I do hope you enjoyed this episode, part, slash whatever you want to call it. And I look forward to seeing you guys in the next part. Take care.